6th August 2022 Saturday Today's scripture portion is taken from the book of Psalms and Psalm 2 verse 8 Ask of me and I shall give heathen for thine inheritance Psalm 2 is one of the royal psalms in other words it is prophetically talking about messiah the lord jesus christ many men of god see this psalm in four stanzas in first stanza we have the rage of the heathen against messiah in other words rebellion against messiah the word messiah we come across in verse 2 the last part where it says his anointed in the second stanza that is from verses 4 through 6 we see the reaction of the heavenly father to the rebellion or rage of the heathen the lord god said in response to the rebellion of heathen that he would set messiah upon the holy hill of zion the messiah here is seen as melech the king as it is written in verse 6 in the third stanza from verses 7 through 9 we see the rule or the reign of messiah the king the dominion of the rule of messiah the king is to the uttermost parts of the earth he will also execute his judgment with a rod of iron in the fourth stanza that is from verses 10 through 12 we are given an exhortation as to how we should respond to the reign and dominion of king the messiah in this way psalm 2 portrays the entire work of messiah lord jesus christ would be rejected of the people and would be crucified for the sins of the people however he is the son of god highly exalted as king by the heavenly father lord jesus christ would be given all authority to reign in his kingdom and therefore we are asked to love him and serve him in today's portion that is psalm 2 and verse 8 we see that the lord god had given lord jesus christ a promise saying ask of me and i shall give heathen for thy inheritance in other words he would be a high priest interceding on behalf of the people for their salvation when lord jesus christ died was buried and rose again all authority was given unto him as we see in matthew's gospel chapter 28 from verses 18 through 20 that the lord said go ye therefore and make disciples of all nations this promise had been fulfilled in lord jesus christ many heathen like us received salvation it is because of the intercessory ministry and sacrifice of lord jesus christ our interceding high priest messiah the lord jesus christ entrusted unto us the ministry of intercession may we therefore ask the lord god interceding him on behalf of the salvation of many people those who are not saved amen